because my soul got traded to someone who literally can't tell me what I'm supposed to be doing? Speaking of, I think your new boss might be looking for you. I'm sure he'll explain everything to you. One finger wag at a time. <laughs> yeah. Did you need me to do something? Well, we'll... Drink with me. If this is too weird for you. Better? It's still kind of weird. This is my true form. Or at least, it used to be. Ferrying souls for a few millennia takes quite a toll on one skincare routine. I'm sorry, but what is happening? You're cute when you're flummoxed. I just... I thought we could chat, get to know each other a little. My name is Lynn, by the way. And... that... was home. Peace. Or some like to call it... Valhalla. That means you're a... God? We didn't know it at the time. We thought we were normal. It wasn't until we met humans that we actually understood that we were different. It's a lot to take in. But you need to hear the whole story. Because I need your help. Every God except my brother Ken. His insatiable desire for conquest led him to find new places where he could be feared and loved. We crossed into your world. That's when wars intensified. More and more humans started arriving in limbo. It started as a slow trickle and then it became a flood. And it seemed so unfair. I saw these poor souls lost to wander in the darkness forever. So I did something stupid. I took pity. I found a mother and child who had died for no reason, and I thought, since the gods had taken away their happiness, I should ferry them across to peace. We colonized their world, so I settled them in ours. When Ken found out, he cursed me. If I was so interested in helping humans, he would force me to do it for all eternity. Never to return home. Always reaching the shore, but never able to actually set foot there. So that's what I've been doing for the last 10,000 years, give or take. That's heavy. I'm sorry. I did it to myself. But now, I am ready to quit. Hang up the robes for good. You see, even though I'm cursed... There's always a loophole. Trust me, I know. Well, the loophole in my curse is I can stop ferrying souls and go home. If I can find someone willing to take my place. But in all the centuries, I have never met anyone willing to do it. For the right reasons, at least. Until I met you. You're awful quiet. And that's coming from someone who hasn't spoken in a few centuries. Why me? Because you remind me of who I used to be. I started off wanting to help as many people as possible. I even broke the rules and sent a few people back to life. You only get away with that once. Nature has a way of restoring the balance. There was a cost to breaking the rules. And I paid it. My heart went numb. It was as if that part of me died. 